So, hello guys. Today we will prepare our crystal wallet which we are using. Our crystal which we are using as a reagent in a gram stain. Remember, a gram stain is the one that needs to differentiate the bacteria depending on their cell weight content. What we call peptidic, peptidic like and like their thickness and at the end, it can be also be used to, to see the pseudo mayfly. So the first thing we have to know about the apparatus. So this here we have our saffron, our satisfied saffron. We have here a weighing bar for weighing, for weighing the correct grams. Here we have our beaker which we have already. We have just measured the liquid which is water, our distilled water. So we have already done it. Water is what type? Yes. Ah. Mm -hmm. We just have it. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So the reagents are the certified saffron in water. We have a distilled water. And we have to go to prepare the lamps. Yeah, we have one. We have also our ethanol here. A counter stain for the bacteria. Where you can get, you can know the color of the gram negative bacteria and the gram positive bacteria. Second, we're going to prepare our crystal violet, which is serves as a primary stain. Then we're going to prepare our IOD, which is a, a modern. Everyone knows the function for modern is just to make the stain stick. Yes. I will be to educate the bacteria and we are going to also prepare our decolorizer which is acetal alcohol. Here, wait for it, it's coming and remember to subscribe. Pinya up with the Gengere Solution of certified saffronine with uh, 45 milliliter of, this, of ethanol. So this is our certified saffronine. And this is our panel. You mix, you mix gently. So after you swallow. So this is a solution of certified saffronine with uh, um, ethanol. So the second procedure, we are going to add um, distilled water, 45 milliliters of distilled water into this solution. Milliliter of solution of ethanol with the saffronine. So we are going to take 5 milliliters from the 45 milliliters. In already be done, then the, the solution will be just ready to be used during the gram staining technique up, so that we can differentiate between. Remember, the gram stain technique can be used to differentiate between the gram negative and the gram positive, and can be also used to visualize the pseudo high fire on the on the east. Yeah? That's why when you are going to talk about candida, candida al albicans is the one of, of the diagonalizing the, 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 the